So, yeah, I think it's going to be a good water cooler conversation uh, show for sure. I was pretty surprised because sure. it kind of changes right at the end. Uh, do you technically think that that arrangement could work going forward for them if she does stay married and she continue, and then just has that side? She has that 15%? I don't know. Brad loved her, that's for sure. He's, uh, you know, you know what he did in episode uh, seven at the end of that. So I, who knows if that will sit well with him. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely not smart enough to be a writer or creator of this show. So whatever they come up with, I know will be surpass anything that I can imagine. So we'll see what they have in store. I mean, I can't imagine Cooper would be okay with it, but even Brad, I mean, he does love her. It's not- Yeah, that's, that's it. Yeah, they're both like, you know, they, you see in episode eight when they bond over the fact that they just love, they, they're both in love with her. And so, yeah, I don't know how well that would sit with either of them. We have to discuss the ending because obviously it's wild and quite the yeah. turn. Uh, yeah. Do you think that that's possible that Billy could live both of these worlds? It doesn't seem like Cooper would be into it. I don't even know if Brad would be into it because he's so in love with her, but is that possible? Yeah. Well, you know, I think that's the question. You know, that is the age old question is, can you have it all? You know, she's a character who she loves her life, but it's not enough. She wants the stability of a relationship and she wants the danger of a relationship and the unpredictability of a relationship. She wants to be a great mom and she wants to go to school and get her degree and work. You know, so it's like these are the things that hopefully if we get a season two, you know, we'll be able to go into and explore.